their songs. My people. Hold up, I'm trying to get the music going. And then Pandora. What the hell you got going on? Shuffle stations. Um, what we got? Red light, green light. Stop, go. All right, there, Air Signs. Say the best for last. We're going to go ahead and knock it out with uh, Aqua Aries first. No, say the best for last. <laughs> All right, Libra first. Well, I guess I might need to do Aquarius first, but I ain't going to do that. Got to say the best for them. Pull up my notes. All right, listen. We still in the energies of the new moon. Energy typically lasts. Two days before and two days after. Now, what's special about this here moon now? This here moon is the first new moon of the summer solstice. These notes, I got them from Dolo. Shout out Dolo and the whole soul group. And this is a permanent change. Typically, you know, when we get hit with waters, right? Now, I'm, I, I did one-on-one -on -one when I'm talking. You hear me when I'm talking? When you see me talking, okay? You hear me when I'm going on the baby? You got to turn down just a little bit. Just a little bit. All right. <laughs> Real life, though. Typically, when we get hit with waves from the energies that are the, that the planets are giving us, it, it's like for a brief moment. And retrograde seasons come. You know how long retrogrades be. And then after that, it's like we back on calm waters. But this here, these here waters that we about to be washed up under, esoterically speaking, okay? I'm not talking third dimensionally speaking. I'm talking about the spirit now, okay? Because planets affect us. The government know that. That's why certain they, they, certain events happen on certain event dates. We know this, okay? Because they need emotional responses from us to get certain shit going for them. Anywho, the world run off emotions. You got to know that. Now... These waters, these waters is going to change the, the sea level. If you know what I'm talking, you know what I'm talking. We're going through a sea level change now, Air Sons. And some people say y'all motherfuckers could be cold. And, and that is true, but we're not cold without reason. You feel me? That's, that's, I, 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 I hope I can speak for us as a whole when we say this. But anywho, the changes we're going through is lifestyle changes. Home life is going to change. Family life is going to change. Who you connect and feel vulnerable with is going to change. And the way you see privacy is going to change. Now, just like for everybody else, that could be negatively or that could be positively. You just got to take it and apply it to your life how you did the apply to your life. The song is playing for you right now. Having our way by the me goes. So you might be having your way right now. Sit out here having this way. I having this way and no yeah you get it nigga whatever <laughs> anywho uh no matter can't to force you the way you feel about area yeah and that all applies to the area you have cancer in your chart so keep that in mind let me let me take this shit a little serious now all right so depending on where you have cancer in your chart, that's the house or that's the, uh, along with the planets, you also got, you all, when you look at a house, you also got to look at the house of that plant, you got planets that are in that house, you feel me? So, because that affects your, that house as well. So not only where you have cancer, apply that house, but then look at the planets and see what the planets in the house are going through. So then you know how that area of your life will be affected in any shape, in any way, shape or form. Now, without further ado, Libra, I'm about to pull a couple cards for you. Mind you, this is a energetic exercise. Being that you are here, you are allowing me into your energetic space. What's up? How you doing? I can't, I'm not going to tell you your future. I'm, not, I'm only going to tell you the space you are in. And if you can make the decision whether you want to move out of that space into a new space or continue to be in that space. The decision is yours. Not a genie. <laughs> For your life, at least. <laughs> you get what I mean? Ooh. I'm not going to take that because I dropped that myself. I don't even want to look at it. I ain't going to look at that. Boom, oh, there we go. Libra. Oh, you got two cards. So this might be an underlying story for you, Libra. 
Y'all seen how much I shuffled you this was it the Knight of Cups for uh Libra? You might be dealing with a I wanna say Pisces or Scorpio. Cause one, they got these same two cards. Or I know Scorpio got this one for a fact. But I feel like Pisces and Scorpio got these. So you might be dealing with one of them signs. And then it's, this is a water sign. So you definitely you may be dealing with a water sign. Or you just real emotional. Water. You may be real emotional right now. Or you may be real passionate. And passionate about something. But you're not trying to take no action. But you want to take action. This is the one. This is the two. So this is the one I saw first. So it's like you want to take a passionate action to towards something. But you not you might not do it, or you, but it makes you emotional. But you're not gonna do it, even though you're emotional about it. What's on the bottom? Yeah. Or you just you 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 your passions all fucked up about it. You may be emotional about it, but you five out five when I say this. But you don't know if if it's if if the passion is there for you. That may be a story for somebody. Take it as a prize to your life. Boom. Yeah. See, you don't want to move away from something. This is Libra. You might not, you might not be, hmm. See, cause it's like, this is like, I'm getting, you should move away from something. You should take your all your thoughts and ideas, bag them up and move away from something. Cause you could say that's a person or you could say that's a person right there. That could be your, um, what is it? Your child, your, like the kid side of you. You, you take your men and women and your, your, playful kid side pack up all your things and get all you take all your thoughts and ideas and go on about your business go on about your emotions go on on another idea go on on another adventure but it's like you don't want to even though you should right you don't want to always oh, pulling up late that was a birth see but it's just like you don't want to give up on something you gonna bring you gonna bring that wherever it's like you're gonna bring whatever you're going away from another offer. You're gonna keep feeding that idea. You're gonna keep trying to nurture that idea. You're gonna keep trying to build off of that idea. You don't wanna give up on it. But it's like you feel like you should. Wait, you might be trying to fight the ways we're going through. You may be trying to fight the ways we're going through. Look, this is the ten of pentacles. Hmm. It's like you don't want to go away from it because you you it's either you feel like I want to say I don't want to say feel because we I don't see no cups I, I got swords and I got pentacles and then we still got the knight of pentacles on the bottom so it's almost like you don't want to go away from something that you know make you make you happy or see I said happy but I don't see no emotions out here. I'm only saying emotions because you can't row a boat on if you're not on water. You feel me? So you might be emotional now. Cancer, see, it makes sense. What's on you got right now? Nobody. See, I'm telling you, is nobody keeps sweat. So you feel it. You might be emotional, but you don't want to be emotional. You just want to be about your pinnacles. You just want to be about your generational wealth. See, my man, gray hair, you want to be about that long money. You want to be about that long stability, that long health, that long happiness. You feel me? Shout out Keith Sweat. And you ain't going to let nobody stop you. I still need one more though. Look, I'm telling you. I'm telling you, yo. You might be going through the fee fees there, Libra. <laughs> Look, ten of pentacles, yo. I mean, ten of cups. You don't want to go away from something that you know make you happy. So you not. You know this shit make you happy. But it might have tried to steal from you. They might have sold a couple of ideas and it ain't work. So it's like you thinking about it. But I don't know if you want to do it. Look, you got so much emotions invested. You done built so much. You know you ain't going to find nobody else like that. 
But uh, you know, you know, you ain't gonna find another idea like that. No lie, I'm telling you. You know nobody else there either. Damn, the whole mood changed. Nobody could do it like that, Libra. You know that. Come on now. Get, get out this thought pattern. You, it, it's either you need to get out this thought pattern or you know you need to get away from this because you know it's not good for you, Libra. All right. Now I got to flip the switch. You know what this is trying to steal from you, but you caught it. So that's the only reason it didn't get away with it. Whether that's an idea, a person, place, a thing in your immediate environment. Keep in mind, this is how we're talking. But you see it though, right? You know you shouldn't fuck with this, but you might still keep fucking with it though. You done built so much. I'm telling you, bro. That's it for you. I might. Look. Cause I did for uh, Pisces on accident. I'ma pull one extra for this one. Just to see what that's all about. What's the six of stones about? Look, look. Look, now you know the, 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 when this happened, that's when the bell rang, Libra. It don't matter if it make you feel like this, you know, it tried to steal from you, Libra. But you don't want to go. But but look, the, look, the, he blowing the horn. Judgment day. Judgment day is. It don't matter if it make you feel like that. It don't matter if you don't put so much of cups into it. It is time to let it go. But you like nobody. I'm out this John Libra. That's all you need. Who could love you like me, Libra? That's how you feel. Who could treat me? That's how you feel, Libra. That's, that's you like that. Listen, it's okay, Libra. It's okay. Gemini! What's poppin', Gemini? We don't go one time. We ain't gotta go through it again. This is how you come in. Whoa! So, what's next? Gemini ready for the next step. What's happening next? Okay. Here we go. What is that? What part is that? Page of Swords. Okay, I'm on 1302. I don't want to shuffle. What, what the shuffle got going on? They ain't gonna cut, try to come for the shuffle game either. There you go. See that? What is that so hard? What is that so hard? You might be leaving somebody in the cold. Gemini is cold outside. Baby, it's cold outside. All right, let me shuffle one more time. All right, dude, you're kind of loud, dude. Yeah, you want like 75%. Ooh, let me scratch the head. Ooh, that cheek was out. All right, let me stop. Okay, I said one more time. My fault, guys. How y'all doing, dude? My bad. I, I know that. I'm shuffling. My fault, guys. We have some snacks, concessions. That's good. It's cool, it's cool, it's cool. No, 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 it's fine, it's fine, it's fine, it's fine. Don't worry, don't worry, don't worry. No, 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 it's cool, it's cool, it's cool, it's cool. It's cool. Boom, one. All right, Gemini, this is you. Now, this could be a person, place, or thing. Person, place, or thing in your immediate environment. Fourth dimensional, third dimensional. 1444 when I said that. Now, you passionate about something. Look at the way he's looking at that idea. 
Look at the way he looking at that person. Look at the way he looking about that wand. You feel me? You real fiery about it. Wands are fire. Keep that in mind. So you may be dealing with a fire sign or you just got to spark about an idea. You just got to spark about a person. You just got to spark about a place. You got to spark about something. Oh, now you're trying to come up with an idea. Whether you, you, you're talking to your mentor, internal men and women, or you're talking to a physical person. All right, my bad there, Gemini. My iPad died. Had to boot it up back real quick. Cannot connect to Pandora. Hold on. Then now we having connection issues. Anyway, yeah. It's like... You got an idea and you ready to make a plan in order to achieve that idea. You ready? Ooh, devil behind that. We don't know as if it's a good idea. Cause the page, you see it's a page now. It's not, it might not be a full blown passion yet. It might not be the best course of action to obtain whatever it is, pentacles you're trying to obtain. The devil manifests the wrong way. You might get caught up. You see how they change. And then you won't be able to blame nobody but yourself for getting caught up. So whatever it is, whatever idea, whatever passion you got, you got that spark. You like, hmm, this is it. I'm going to do it. I'm going I'm to hit big on this one. Look at the way. Look, you are admiring that idea. Like, it is the greatest thing that's going to enter your headscapes. Right? Still trying to boot up the pen. There we go. I'm the plug. You feel like the plug right now. Shout out Pandora. Because of that passion. Relax though. Because in the cut. Might not be the best thing. One, two, three. When I say it, that. Alright, so that's the one. It's the two. What is the two for you? What is the two for you? Oh. Look, that you might not take action on that passion. Though it may make you emotional, though you may want to move on it. Excuse me. You feel me? You're looking at it like, ooh, this might be the one I got to jump on. You done made a, you done built emotions on it. See, you got you a little water. You got you just a little river in the bike. You not you might not it might you it's it's like you going through a phase this season. You probably in a space where it's like, oh that's a good idea. Oh that looks like a good person. Oh that looks like a good thought. But it's a page, and you probably know it's a page because this is you. So you like, but I know it's not the best course of action. I know I shouldn't do that idea. I know that idea won't fulfill me emotionally because it's a cup. So you may be dealing with a water sign or you may be dealing with a passion that you are emotionally connected to. See, and, and this is still on the bottom. So it's like you you plotting on how to do it. You probably plotting on how to do it. So it's like you won't catch an L in the end. Probably whatever it is, whatever that is to you, whatever the it is to you in your life. Look, and you probably going to end up just saying fuck the whole idea. It's like you you got an idea, right? It may it, it might be an immature idea. That's why you thinking about it. You thinking like, hmm, I don't know if this going to work. Should I do it? I mean, I don't know, bro. It might work. You you just got to do it this way and that way. Hmm, I don't know if that's it though. You feel me? That's out of the internal battle you have in the internal communication you having with yourself. Or this is somebody else you talking to about that idea. Some three through three when I said that. Somebody you talking to in your immediate environment about whatever idea you got, right? Remember, that idea could be something that, an idea like a manifestation, something you want to bring into your reality, a passion, or idea in the sense of like a person, place, a thing in your immediate environment, right? But you like, hmm, after over, after thinking about this, after going through the whole cycle of the three thoughts. Right, you was like, I don't know if that's the best course of action for me emotionally, though I may be passionate about it. I don't know if I should do that. So I'ma just leave it alone. Yeah, you know what, passion, just I I don't wanna do this passion. I'ma wait for another. I thought about it and I came to the conclusion that it might not be in my best interests emotionally. If I were to take that action, because it's nothing but a page. 
You feel me? It ain't a whole book. How I'm supposed to write a whole story? How I'm supposed to get these pinnacles with only one piece of the page? You feel me? 444 when I said that. Song that's playing is needed. See, you may think you need it. You may just think you need it. Look how you looking at it. You like, God damn. But I don't know if it's in your best interests emotionally. And you may know that because you thinking. Boy, you up there thinking about it. But you may or may not. This could be positive or negative again. Apply it to your life as it may be, wherever you have Gemini in your chart. Look at it. Apply that there. Next, Aqua Aries. You got the song playing. You might need it. Somebody might need you or you might need it. What, Whatever it is, you may need that. You feel me? Or, or you are it to somebody and somebody needs it, which is you. You feel me? Catch that. Cool, you caught it. Oh no, they said you didn't shuffle for them. And you're right. I didn't shuffle for them. You may be avoiding taking some immature action there, Aquarius. Because you, you got a perspective on the situation and you standing firm, so you're not going to take no immature actions. That's the story for somebody. You're not gonna act like these cards not here. That that idea could be a passion. That could be a person, place, a thing in your immediate environment. Fourth dimensionally speaking, you could you could have got an idea. You could have got a, something that came to your mind like, hmm, this may be a good course of action. Third dimensionally speaking, you looked at a person and it's like, oh, I should react to that. I should interact with that. You know, I should take action on that. But you got a perspective or you can't, you're set in a perspective and you're like, no, I'm not going to do that because it was in reverse. Take that as it applies to you though, Aqua Aerials. And it's like, you, you're you not taking passion, but some, some, something in your environment might need it. Some might need you to take passion. Some, look, because you're not taking the passion, you might be breaking the heart. It's either you breaking your heart or somebody else's heart. Take it as it applies to you, Aqua Aries. This is the last shuffle before we pour them three quarts. Look, you done broke the shuffle. I don't know what you got going on there, Aqua Earths. Three cards, Aqua Earths. Boom, the star, this came out upright. So this you, Playboy, and not to mention, this is your card. The star of Aquarius. Look, that's you right now. So look, look, you you got you got enough emotions for the world and your goddamn self. Look, you about to take a bath in them waters. And all the stars in white, but that one star, that's you, Playboy. You're shining yellow, Leia. I need more to the story. And you tempered. Your temperature not too hot. Your temperature not too cold. Look, you got one foot on the ground. You got one foot on the 3D and one foot on the fourth dimensional emotional region. You got one foot in, one foot out. You balanced. And then not to mention angel, you got a higher angle. Universe probably bringing balance to a situation that look, it's a third perspective, the triangle. So one is you, two is outside of you. Third is the perspective on both points. Hold on, let me give him a pointer, goddamn. You see that? That's one, one is looking at two, two is looking at one, and three is looking at one and two. So universe is three, this is you, this is somebody else, the universe might be tempering some shit out. And the sun is rising on the horizon and you the goddamn star playboy. Now whatever they're balancing out may be emotional. It's something outside of you balancing some shit out though. Something that has a higher enlightenment because that's you and that may be somebody else. That may be another idea. You may take one idea that made you emotional and, and instead of investing more time into that idea, you spend more time into this idea. So you're taking from that idea as far as putting thoughts, trying to get ideas to build on that idea, you're trying to build on this idea. You feel me? You just got to take it how it applies to you. But something's being balanced out. Something's being tempered in your life. 
and you're a star because of it. Right now, the song that's playing is Pose, Boulder, Pose on Boulder Crest. Pooh Shiesty, Boucher Mine, LaFleur. LaFleur. I need the two for Aqua Herbs. Aqua Herbs. All right, y'all don't want to talk no more, bro. As I, I understand y'all might not want to speak. Y'all ain't got no goddamn choice. Let me hear it. Let me hear it. What the heck? Okay, I guess up. Okay. Oh, kind of. Oh, boom. Look, too. This outside of you. Somebody probably was trying to steal from me. Whether the, this is air. So these may be somebody was trying to steal your thoughts. Somebody was trying to steal your ideas. Somebody was trying to steal your communication. Something. Somebody was taking something, because upright, this is somebody's look, looking directly at you. You're not even looking at them. You focused on what the fuck you got going on. Whole time, they trying to steal from you. Look, they look. They already got a couple of them stars. They want to see if they can come back later and get all the stars. But like this, though, you caught, you, you ain't looking at them, but you was looking at them. Now they, now they don't want to take no more action. Because this is the uh, Knight, of, Knight of Wands in reverse. Like this, somebody want to take a quick, passionate action towards something. Let them, let them when I said that. Let them, let them. Right? But like this, ain't no action being taken. Because the, the, the jig is up. Look, look at you. I could see you. Did you know that I could see you? You thought you was slick? Whole time, you ain't slick. You ain't slick. I need one more. Oh, that fell out quickly. Look. Look, it's like this you right now. You look, you, you tend into your waters, and then you pouring the water over here while you tend into your waters. Somebody tried to steal from you. Whole time, somebody was trying to take from you, whether that is fourth dimensionally. You was probably trying to take from yourself in a mental aspect. Take some I take time from one take time from feeding one idea mental mind frame and say what ideas you know you were supposed to be building upon. Ideas you know you were supposed to be trying to manifest. Whatever that if that's a person, place, or thing, whatever. You know you were supposed to be manifesting something, but you wasn't manifesting it. So you was if it's upright, you was taking I you was taking time from other ideas trying to give them to some bullshit. You feel me? Because you're sneaking off doing this. So mentally, you know you're not supposed to be investing in those thoughts and ideas, those those that mental communication, that negative chatter in your head. But you like, eh, it's okay, I do it anyway. Like this, you not communicate. Forth. I'm speaking about what's going on in your mind right now. May or may not be, depending if this is for you, this is for you. But you may, you might, you might not be having that negative chatter in your head. You might not be doing that no more. And if, and if you are having negative chatter in your head, it's like you know exactly what to say to the negative chatter to get it to stop. But right now, you're not having no negative chatter, so you sleep. You see him, you see him. But look at, look at his hand, look at, look at the formation. Look at the form, he got the Bernie Sanders going on. He, look at the formation. Look at the formation, and he, it's like, I done, I done said what I had to say about them thoughts. I done said what I had to say at 30, 13, 31 when I said that. I had said what I had to say about them feelings. So I'm, I'm asleep on it. You know, them negative thoughts, you know, they annoying. I'm tired of them. They ain't coming right now, so I'm sleeping on them. But if that motherfucker come back, I got a couple words. If I got to get up at this bed. You know how when you in school, you miss the bus and you scared to wake your parents up? It's like that. If I gotta get up out this bed, I got a couple words. I still got a sword. Just cause all my swords hung up. And I look like I ain't paying attention, you feel me? Whole time I'm watching you. That's how you got caught, player. You got caught cause you thought you might have almost had it because this is out. So regardless, 
Sure. Mine almost had it. What's on the bottom? But I'm telling you. Look. Love is what the star. You ain't, you ain't get it. You ain't getting it. 1444. You ain't getting it. Song that's playing is advertising. So, hey. You might be on pause for something. You might be on hold. It's like you in a waiting lobby. but And you resting. But it's like, eh. I, I could get up if I had to. I ain't gonna get up, though. I already done caught you. So now I'm gonna focus on my shit. While still pouring to the world. I'm gonna grow, I'm gonna I'm tend to my waters while still growing these flowers. While still getting these stars busting. You feel, you dig what I'm saying there, Aquarius? Look, I'm telling you. You done got the A-OK -okay from life and was like, go for it. That's the, that's the one. Go ahead. You ain't taking no offers from no strangers. Yeah, don't, don't even come over here with that cup. Don't even, you better not come over here with that cup. Look, Aquarius, that's it. That's the air signs. That's, that's, that's Libra. Libra, you ain't nobody. Gemini, you, you going, you might be going through the motions in Aquarius. You being a star, you being the star, you, you, your own car came out, Playboy. You being the star of your life right now, player. Good on you, G. That's my people, Aquarius Sun out here. I got seven different Aquarius placements. Ask about me, look. Oh shit, no, that was right. I split, I just split the deck, Playboy. Aquarius, all my aquas out there. If you know you planted good seeds, now I'm not talking to the Aquariuses that know they out here doing dumb shit. If you know you out here being low vibe, this ain't for you. Now you know this this message ain't for you. You better not. Don't 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 light yourself up. Alright? Don't gaslight yourself. Don't boost yourself. Don't stroke your own ego. If you know you out here planting good seeds though, you're on your way. You see me? You're on your way. Keep resting, player. You balling out of control, bro. Scholarships. I'ma holler at y'all. Eee, eee.